Hey guys, it's Twisted GA, and today I've got a video on what I bought at ASIN uh, recently, a couple of days back from when you're watching this video. But when I'm making this video, it's one day back. I went to ASIN uh, anime convention in Chicago, and we got a couple of stuff. I've got a couple of stuff that I bought there. I'm mostly just posters from uh, Artist Alley, but I wanted to share them and show you guys what I got. So the first thing that I have was uh, what's on the thumbnail, and it is uh, that painting. Just a sec, and it is this one. Uh, it's called Nightmare. And it is from Boomslink is what they have. Uh, the website, I'll leave the website links down in the comments. I mean, down in the description. But it's from Boomslink. And uh, it's a pretty cool drawing. I like it because it, it kind of reminds me of, gives me the ring type of feeling. Uh, the horror feeling. And I like everything. I like the coloring. I like how pale everything is. I like uh, all the stuff that's happening around the picture. The signs are pretty cool. The one thing I would have to say is negative is the little sign you'll see right next to the yellow. There's a little writing on it. It kind of looks like it was made in pen, uh, which is kind of distracting a little bit. kind of feels like it was, I don't know, made it right at the end. I don't know. I'm not sure how to say. But apart from that, everything looks cool. The vanishing point, everything looks proportioned correctly. And I liked it a lot, so that's why I picked it out. It is made on, it feels like it's printed on construction paper. I think that's what you would call it. Construction paper type of thing. Um, so it feels really nice, and I can't wait to hang this up in my room. So uh, that's the first thing, Nightmare. And uh, you can, guys can buy it online for 20 bucks. Uh, they had a couple other stuff that was really, really awesome that I'll be buying later on. But I didn't have the money <laughs> at the moment, so I was only able to get this one from them. So for the next thing, I got another post. I, I basically only got posters. In, uh, and the next one is a canvas that we got from, uh, again, Artist Alley, which... You guys can't see on camera very well, but I'll show you guys. <laughs> I'll edit this so that you guys can see everything better. And that is made on canvas paper. It feels kind of funny. You guys can see a little bit of the, the stuff just popping out. That you can grab onto it. I don't know what you would call that. But the string type things. Uh, the, art is, the art is really nice. Um, there's one thing that I was wondering. Because because I checked the artist up on Patreon. and Because uh, I asked. I was like, can I buy my stuff online? Because I didn't, I didn't have enough money to buy another one of this there was another awesome was uh, bait uh, saber and I asked can you buy more online and they said I could but th I'd have to pay for shipping and handling so it would be better if I bought it right there and I was like okay but they never gave me the website or anything like that and uh, that made me kind of weird I was like, it made me think I'm like why aren't they giving me out information so I looked up the artist everything like that it took a little bit to find the, this picture specifically and then it turns out it's from an artist all the way in China and uh, I looked them up on Twitter, I looked up their Patreon, everything, I followed everything. And uh, they had no mention of them being at ASIN, so I don't know about that. Um, I'm not sure what's going on there. I don't know if, if the person selling the stuff at the artist uh, vendor had the permissions. Maybe they did. I'm not quite sure. But the fact that they didn't link me, link me or have any way of me knowing who the original artist was is what kind of made me a little iffy on it. But uh, hopefully they did have the, the correct information on... Uh, they had the correct rights to sell this artwork because it's really cool but I will be linking the actual artist on uh, on the description and they did have another another awesome saber which I will be getting on canvas uh, hopefully around this same size but uh, that's not the second thing and the final posters are actually three of them I got them from the same person this one I know actually made their things uh, it's Mijo Studios right there I don't know if hopefully you can see it uh, hopefully I'll put that in again but uh, it's really cool. Uh, she was selling three posters, um, not three posters, multiple posters, and uh, they had the this steel which was two for two get one free. They had another one which was just this ginormous poster that you could get for fifty, and then they had another one that was an eight dollars for a metallic poster, which I don't actually know what a metallic poster is, um, so I didn't buy that one. But I got the two for three deal. And the first one that originally caught my eye, actually I'll show that one at the end, but this is Ari from uh, Fate. Fate. This is Ari from League of Legends, there you go. And uh, it's right there. And it was pretty cool, I like the art on it really. It is, it's Ari basically from League of Legends. Everything's well drawn, I like the color. The, the paper is on, uh, it's kind of glossy and it's smooth, your hand slide on it. Uh, not paper paper, and it's not on a... Uh, and it's not made on poster board paper, but it is really nice, and I like it. It feels like it's durable. I like the coloring on it. Everything looks nice. There's I really don't see any mistakes on it, and 
it seems like if, if it would obviously it's done online digital but it would, seems like it was like on watercolor type brushes I'm not sure actually um, on the tail parts it looks really really nice I liked it so I ended up getting this one the lines are all really nice too they're all straight everything looks up really well on this painting uh, the next one that I got from there was this Ruby poster clear clear and uh, I like this one too I like Ruby the the show was really cool it's really nice and uh, I saw this poster too and I was like oh I'll pick this one up since I was two for two two get one free I was like okay I'll pick this one up too I mean it looks nice I like the characters in Ruby and I like the, the weapons everything just looks really cool so I decided to get a poster from it and I am not disappointed by this one And the final poster, and the one that most caught my eye, was this Saber poster. And I actually, I like this one a lot, just because I, I'm a fan of Saber. I have so much uh, Fate Stay Night stuff. I have a figure, I got a giant poster, which you can kind of see in the back. Wow. And that's more of a wall scroll. And then I have this one now. So, another Fate Stay Night thing added to my collection, of, specifically of Saber. And I was pretty happy, I liked the coloring, I liked everything. On it, the coloring was nice, the background was nice, the eyes were nice, so I just ended up, I'm like, oh man, I have to have this, so I ended up getting it. And with that, that's basically all I got at uh, ASIN. Hopefully you guys found this interesting, hopefully, maybe next year, well, depends on how stuff goes, maybe I'll go next year or not. Uh, there's a couple stuff coming up, and I'm not sure if I'll be able to go to ASIN next year, but anyway, uh, with that, I end it, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.